The moon had lighted up some of our strangest adventures, but none so strange as this. From an earthbound creature for centuries, man had become a moonbound creature. This vast but simple truth gave majesty to the faultless liftoff. T minus 15 seconds, guidance is internal. 12, 11, 10, 9, ignition sequence starts. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, all engine running. Liftoff, we have a liftoff. 32 minutes. It's a thrilling sight as that yellow flame and white smoke bellows from beneath the giant Saturn V rocket. Ahead. You can hear it blasting into the sky. There it goes, beautifully straight up, destination moon. You hear it at the press site, all the members of the press clapping. It's climbing straight up with Neil Armstrong, Michael Collins, and Buzz Aldrin aboard that mighty Saturn V rocket. Climbing straight up, it is a beautiful sight. Almost unbelievable that that rocket is headed directly towards a lunar landing. And faultless it was. Cool, smooth, primed with expertise. So much so that many of us programmed as we are for the ruins and mishaps of well-made plans, could hardly believe it. Then there was the simple, uncomplicated Americanism of the astronauts. For instance, a greeting from outer space to the Boy Scout Jamboree in Idaho. I'd like to say uh, hello to all uh, my fellow scouts and scatters at uh, Farragut State Park in Idaho. They have the National Jamboree there this week, and Apollo 11 like to send them best wishes.